Alrighty guys, today I'm here with Jenna. Hey. And she has a cold, so that's why she's gonna sound funny. But yeah. <laughs> we have this Basher Science card game and some figure packs. I have done a Basher Science review slash opening before on the channel of just the figures. I never got the card game. So Mattel sent me the card game, so thank you so much to Mattel for sending this to me. Uh, we are going to play this, see what it's all about. Um, Let's just take a look at this closer. And I'm really excited for these mammal cards. I hope they make mammal figures. Um, I would be in trouble though. Um, that's this, so cute. Yeah, this one comes with a little heart, the figure included. Two games in one. Battle and match with science facts. It's not focusing for some reason. Okay, this is for ages six and up and two players. And these, this is from the makers of Uno. And then here is an example of the battle game and the match game. Uh, what do you? Oh, we were thinking we we're gonna play the battle yeah. game because the match game looks too easy. You just gotta match the cards. Uh, grow your powers with additional cards found in our minifigure collection. And then look for our other card packs. So there's two other card packs which I have seen at the stores. Um, this one is geared towards biology. Uh, what I'm gonna do is Jen. I'm gonna have Jenna open this so she can read it, and we are going to open the figure packs. I have the chemistry pack here, the bigger pack with three figures and then this cute little carry thing and it comes with six game cards. And these are all the different sets you can, or packs you can collect. There's two for the rocks and minerals, two for the biology and uh, two for the chemistry, but this is the other chemistry ones that you can possibly get. It's so cool when you like actually took those classes and you actually know what they are. <laughs> yeah. It's been a while since I've been in school though, so I'm a little worried. Jenna's probably gonna cream me on this in this game. So here is a little carrying case kind of thing. You just put your figure in there and then there's this little clip. You can clip it on your backpack, your purse, whatever you want to take it on the go. Um, let's take a look at the little figures we got. We have gas. This is so cute. Let's see if we can get this to focus. Gas is so adorable. It's translucent at the top. And then we have, we have solid. Solid is adorable. And then we have the last figure, which is Liquid. Liquid is totally cool. He is completely see-through. And then we have the cards, which I'm gonna go ahead and get those open. Here are the cards. So the first one we have here is the gas card. I am the state of matter with the highest amount of energy. Chemistry, if your opponent played a five or six, you can win. And then gas again, I expand and fill any container that I am put in. And then we have solid, I am the lowest energy state of matter. Uh, when heated, my particles vibrate and I melt into a liquid. And liquid, I take the shape of any container that I am put into. Heating turns me into gas, freezing makes me solid. And then here are the little ones you can collect from the chemistry. Test tube is so cute and so is thermometer. <laughs> Cards included are compatible with our game packs. Kind of curious. I don't know for sure. John is reading up on the game, but can if since we got the biology game, can we we can't use these chemistry cards? Can we? I don't know. We'll have to see. Next, we have the magnite pack. It's the single figure pack. This is for the rocks and minerals. Two game cards included. So let's go ahead and get this open. So here he is out of the box. He's super cool. I like his cape. These are such nice figures. They're mostly solid. This cape here is very flexible, but the figures themselves are very hard plastic. And then we have our cards. So I have a shady guy found on the black sand beaches. And I am a shady guy found on the black, that's the same card. <laughs> um, and then here are all these rocks and minerals little guys you can collect. Super cute. So now it's time to play the game. So for battle, you split the deck into two one for each of us and then you like we each flip one over and we compare like the number so like if i flipped over this one and she flipped over this one we would compare the number mine's higher but if you read the power it says your opponent gets plus one so she would get four and then but it says lowest number wins the round so she Just would win 
Okay. And then matching, you spread them all out. Mm -hmm. And then I'll flip two over. And like, let's say they don't match. I would just read the description to Tiffy. I wouldn't tell her what it is. Because she would have to like think, oh, that's the protist. And then I would flip them back over and she would have to remember to get a match. Okay. That's uh, it sounds like it's really cool that you get two games in this deck, and you could probably do just you could make up your own game. I mean, you can do a matching game for like younger children, just match the pictures or stuff. And you learn so many cool facts from this, it looks so fun. Um, we are definitely gonna play the battle game though, right? Mm -hmm. You want to play the battle game? So, we're gonna play the battle game today. We're gonna go ahead and get set up here. You get these cards in the deck, and they are, sh uh, well, this one is the short game scorecard, and this is the long game scorecard. You're going to have to walk us through the first, first little okay, roundy I'll round here. Flip over. Okay. Okay, I've seedless plants, and you have flowering plants. Uh, cancels your opponent's ability. Your opponent gets to look at your hand. Huh. <laughs> so, I win. So, do you get the card? Oh, okay. Where's those little scorecard things you were just talking about? Right here. Okay, so we each get a token. And we'll move it up like I just got one. Oh, I gotcha. Let's do the long game card then. Long oh, game card. I'll just put it up here. So, I'm still on zero then. You do get these little cute little game pieces as well. Alright, so then what do we put this at the bottom or is this out? Like, completely? I think it's just out. Whatever. Okay. Long, so we are a pair of bags located on both sides of your chest. Plus two if the opponent's card is even. Oh, no. This is, it swapped this card with your opponent's card. So then, oh, this is T-cell. I keep you healthy by recognizing and killing invaders. Okay, so you win that one. Yay. Okay, ready? Oh my gosh, I love these. <laughs> Little mammals. Okay, T-cell again. Card with the longest name wins the round. Mm. Okay, we switch. Oh man, so then you win. Well, it says card with the longest name wins next round. Oh, next round, sorry. So, I would win right now, and then mm -hmm. whoever has the longest name next side wins. Oh, you win. Oh, uh, yes! Look at the little bird bird pictures, they're so cute. I really, I heard that they're coming out with new figures in the spring, I believe. And I really hope they're bird raiser mammals. Oh my gosh, I would buy them all. Um, your opponent doesn't. We weren't even moving this. You move it. You move just one, right? Well, from last time. Okay. I only won once. But you won this one. Yeah. Well, don't we, don't we do this at all? No, because whoever has the last Okay. Time wins. Okay. All right. Next one. Prototus. We are indeed the planets of animals. Your opponent gets plus one. Uh, Plus two, your opponent card is even. Jeez. Okay, you win. No, you win. Well, I would get four and five, and you still have eight. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes. And see those plants again. Cancels your opponent's ability. It's seven three. or eight. Nope. So you win. Okay, then. <laughs> that works. Alright guys, I need two more and I win. <laughs> Reptiles! Aww. They are some loving species. Rocks and minerals with card. Rocks and mineral cards are worth plus two next round. We didn't add any other cards yeah, yeah. in here. We just added, or I mean just did the card deck that originally came with this. Uh, if your opponent played a seven or eight, win the next round. Or win the round. So who won then? You did. Because you're still higher than me. Oh, okay. I keep forgetting about the numbers. Mammal's card with the longest name wins next round. Your opponent gets doesn't get to draw after this round. Mm -hmm. I don't know. We must have forgot a roll. Oh. At the end of each round, place your played card face up in your discard pile oh. and draw back up to three cards. Oh, well, who cares? Whoopsies. Well, we're already <laughs> this far into it, so we're just going to keep going. Yeah. Uh, so card with the longest name wins next round. I got flowering plants. Haha! <laughs> Alright then. Two more cards, which normally it would replenish. Yeah. Heads 
plus two tails, negative two. And you just flip the coin. Okay. But I would still win, I think. Right. Yeah. Okay. I need a, I need a win. Lowest number wins this round. So I do. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> I just won. <laughs> See, this is so cool. I think it would be so much more fun with a bigger deck, obviously. Yeah. So the more figures you get and the more packs that you get, it works. It works. And these cards are so cute. Like the illustrations. I love... What's your favorite card? I like the protists one and the lungs. Oh, the lungs are funny. I love these guys, obviously. Reptiles, mammals, and invertebrates. The lungs are great. They're so cute. Oh, where's the figure we got in this pack? The oh, little yeah, heart. Yeah. You got the little heart. So cute. Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I want to thank Mattel again for sending this over to me. It is super cute. Such a super cute game. I love the card drawing slash illustrations. I love the little figures. The figures are amazing. I love the facts. I love everything about this. What is, what's your opinion, Jenna? It's really cute and I like that you learn. Yeah, that's the it's part. definitely like it's not even hard, difficult facts or anything. Like mm -hmm. Lung said, what did it say? Two bags on the side <laughs> of your chest, which is super easy to remember and it's really cool. But anyway, make sure you guys let me know which which card we got today was your favorite. Like I said, I love the mammals, reptiles, and invertebrates. Jenna is into the lungs the and the protus. Let us know your favorites. Also, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.